Hey everybody, Flaming Jackson here. I hope everybody's doing all right today. This is the moment y'all all have been waiting for. Today, I'm going to be attempting to do Mad Bull Cow Butterscar uh, Butterscotch Bark here, y'all. Once again, this is Mad Bull Cow Butterscotch Bark. This here uh, was a collaboration with uh, Uncle Bull Cow and Harvest 912. Um, before I get started here, what Harvest 912 is, Harvest 912 produces hot sauce, spicy treats, and extreme League of Fire challenges under the name Mad Cow Products. 100% of the profit for Mad Cow sales Support our mission of providing foot care and new footwear to those in need. And that's a great cause. You know, any way that we can give back to those that's less fortunate, you know, that's a great cause. And, you know, um, we need to help those in need all we can. You know, we really do. You know, we never realize, you know, where somebody's at, you know. You might look at somebody, you know, think they're all right. But in reality, you know, they're a mess on the inside. But, you know... Um, I really do like this cause, and, you know, I really think they're great people, um, and it's just a blessing to those, you know, it really is, um, it really is, you know, but now to the challenge, y'all, um, once again, this is, uh, Mad Bull Cow Butterscotch Bark, this is a League of Fire Challenge product, two ounces. Alright y'all here, on the back here it says hashtag chili heads on a mission. Harvest 912 produces hot sauce, spicy treats, and extreme league of fire challenges under the name Mad Cow Products. 100% of the profits from Mad Cow sales support our mission of providing foot care and new footwear to those in need. Chili heads on a mission produces producers like our friend Uncle Bull Cow donate peppers, powders, great challenge ideas, and a ton of love to our cause. Ingredients, sugar, hydrogenated oil, cocoa powder, non-fat dry milk, soy lexin, vanillin, Uncle Bull Cow Super Hot Mix, caramel, primatale, chocolate, seven pot primo, death spiral, and peach reaper. Natural flavors, molasses, cream, and sea salt, y'all. If y'all are interested in trying any of these products, you can visit their website at www.harvest912.org forward slash products. Alright y'all, now for the rules of this challenge. <clears throat> Mad Bull Cow Butter Scotch Bark League of Fire Challenge Rules. No food or drink for the duration of the challenge. You must... Video your challenge without edits and remain on camera at all times until the challenge is complete. Read the short disclaimer found at the bottom of the leagueoffire.com forward slash disclaimer clearly into the camera. The bark must be opened from a sealed packet on screen. Remain on screen until fully consumed. The bark must be chewed, not swallowed whole. After fully consuming, show an empty mouth and then begin full minute burn time. You may not pick toffee bits out of your teeth during the burn time. After four minutes, you have completed the challenge. Bonus challenge, two additional packages of bark equals two bonus points. All right, so I just got to eat this, chew it up, um, show my tongue, and then do a four-minute afterburn. As far as I know, there ain't no time limit on you know how quick I got to eat this, um, but there's a four-minute suffer session after I finish. All right, y'all, um, now for the disclaimer. I don't have to read the disclaimer this time because I have a subscriber bypass. Yes, subscriber bypass. Something new, the League of Fire just started, you know, for the subscriber, you know, on our Facebook and everything. I mean, it's a great perk. I mean, I get this disclaimer bypass. I get discounts and a lot of other great stuff that comes along you know, with it. But we got this taken care of. Disclaimer bypass. Alright.
got this on camera here. And as y'all can see, it has not been opened. Seal is still on here. Okay. <clears throat> Let's open this up and hopefully I prepped good. <laughs> Hoping and praying I got my tolerance up enough, y'all. Um, I haven't done a challenge in a long time, so... Um, I'm definitely nervous, I really am. But I know it's going to be alright, I mean... I'm looking forward to it, you know. I, sometimes I'm my worst on um, my worst enemy. I mean, just I think the worstest things, you know, I think it's going to hurt me so bad. And lots of times, you know, it's not as bad as I thought it would be. Um, I'm not saying that's the case of all challenges, but usually that's the way it goes. I overthink stuff. But all right, y'all, let's open this up and get this party started, y'all. To see, see, I'm opening this on camera. All right, that's open. Hopefully, this thing is in the frame the whole time. Let's open here. It's going to be a little stubborn. That's all right. I'm stubborn too. So, to be stubborn with it. Oh my gosh. Butterscotch it has amazing butterscotch flavor. I just can't get over how delicious it smells. It just makes my mouth water just smelling um, the aroma coming from this butterscotch bark. But all right, y'all, to the challenge. Look at that. Ain't that beautiful? So beautiful. Enough stalling. <laughs> it's so delicious, y'all. That's empty.
Ah. All right, now. Now for the full minute afterburn. I do have to say, y'all, this is an amazing challenge. It's definitely a beginner challenge. Don't get me wrong, it has, it has, it has really good heat. But this is definitely a really good challenge for a beginner that's just now getting on their, you know, their journey. Their spice chasing journey. <laughs> um, I had to say, this uh, butterscotch bark here, um, collaboration, you know, you know, with the mad, um, with um, Uncle Bull Cow and, you know, Mad Cow, it's a great collaboration. And like I say, it's a great cause. I mean, what better way to help those in need and get the stuff you like, you know, your spicy related stuff and products. I mean, it's a win-win. I mean, I'm getting what I like, what I love, which is spice, peppers, you know, great flavors. And and in the process, you know, we're helping those that's less fortunate. I mean, that's a blessing there. It really is, y'all. Uh, any way that we can give back to those that's, you know, in need, you know, that's great. You know, we need to help each other all we can. And, you know, there's a lot of way, a lot of ways that we can give back. It really is. But I do have to say, I love this Mad Boy Cow Butter Scotch Bark. The only thing I regret is I didn't buy more. Because... This would be great to just snack on. I mean, it really is. Like I say, it's definitely a great beginning, beginner challenge, but I could see me just snacking on this throughout the day. I mean, I mean, you can't just have one bite. I mean, you can't. <sighs> I know that about me. I guess it's where I got an addictive personality, but I tend to go overboard on just about everything. And it's... It's like I don't know when to stop. <laughs> Cause I guarantee you if I had another two or three of these, I'd, I'd be ke I'd keep on eating them. Uh, but I don't have any more, y'all. <laughs> um, for flavor, I'm going to give this a 10 out of 10. It actually tastes better than a 10. Um, but I just can't get over how delicious it is. How, how much it... I mean, it just makes my mouth water. The aroma, the flavor... And you can tell that these are quality ingredients in this challenge here. I mean, quality. A lot of love put into making these products. And, you know, it's a blessing to be able to try this challenge. Let y'all know what I think about it. I definitely recommend this challenge. And I, I recommend... Um, um, there are other products, too. I mean... Harvest 912, Uncle, um, Uncle Bull Cow, they're both great, great people and everything, and they, have, they all, uh, they have great products, they really do. They got a lot of other challenges too, I'm looking forward to doing, I haven't got to do the, um, what was it, uh, I forgot what you call it, that Mad Cow Lick or something, if I'm not, if I'm not mistaken, they got that, they got the, the Maddie's Peppermint Bark Challenge, um, and I, I haven't tried the peppermint, the peppermint bark challenge. I've tried the regular peppermint bark, but I haven't tried the challenge yet. But I'll definitely, definitely be doing that soon. I look forward to doing it. Um, but this is a great challenge. All right, y'all. That four minutes is over with. Um, I would say for my heat level, at my highest, I probably got up to maybe about a maybe a three um but my heat's already started going back down now so i would say right now my mouth burn is i would say probably a one i can still feel a little tingling on my tongue a little warmth but for the most part the heat is done you know went away but like i say this is a great beginner ch challenge just about anybody, you know, should be able to do this challenge. And, uh, like I say, once you try it, I mean, it's hard to stop eating this stuff. 
But I thank y'all so much for watching this video. If y'all like this video, please um, hit the like button, subscribe, share. Make sure you hit the notification bell, that way you'll be aware of any future videos that come out, y'all. Uh, it'll be more from where it came from, y'all. Um, I love y'all so much. It sure makes it a lot easier having to read that disclaimer, y'all. Disclaimer bypass. <laughs> well, that was the challenge, y'all. Uh, I thank y'all uh, so much for watching this. It'll be more for us came from. I hope y'all have a blessed night. And remember, you are loved.